Hello everyone, this is Kay with Japan National Tourism Organization. In this video series, I'd like to take you on a tour of Japan's different regions to share with you what makes each one special in its own right, and to give you an idea of what you can do and expect while traveling to them. Japan has 10 different regions which are further segmented into 47 prefectures. Each area has its own something special, with unique dialects, customs, and cultures to explore, and every region has a great day trip option to maximize your trip. So join me as we travel across Japan. Make sure to take note of what inspires you most so you can save it for future travel planning. The next region we'll be traveling to is the Hokuriku Shiatsu region, which is located in the northwestern part of Japan. This region is best known for its unrivaled mountain views, beautiful coastlines, endless outdoor adventure, and amazing seafood. And being an easy trip from Tokyo by bullet train, you can usually get to the Hokuriku Shinetsu area in as little as 90 minutes, so it's very easy to go from the urban cities to the towns and villages of the Japan Alps. This region has five prefectures, Niigata, Nagano, Toyama, Ishikawa, and Fukui. Let's start with Niigata Prefecture, which is easily accessible by Joetsu Shinkansen. In Niigata, winter sports reign supreme, but summer activities like hiking, fishing, and nature trekking are also worth checking out. Niigata also offers exceptional hot springs, seafood, rice, and of course sake, with plenty of sake breweries and local varieties to choose from. Nagano Prefecture is an outdoor sports mecca with some of the best skiing and snowboarding in Japan. Often called the roof of Japan, it boasts some of the highest mountain ranges in the country, known as the Japan Alps. The summer months also offer plenty of hiking, kayaking, canyoning, and rock climbing. Rural culture continues much as it has for centuries in historic post towns such as Tsumago and Narai. You can also explore samurai history at Matsumoto Castle before taking a trip to one of many rustic onsen villages and cities like Karuizawa and Kamikochi are great places to escape the heat during the summer months. Toyama Prefecture is famous for the world heritage Gokayama villages and the towering snow walls of the Tatayama Kurobe Alpine Route, which is also beautiful to visit in the fall when the leaves have changed colors. It's also home to some of Japan's most spectacular forests and waterways, with plenty of places to hike, like Kurobe Gorge, and lots of delicious seafood, like their iconic firefly squid. Easily accessible from Osaka and Kyoto, Fukui Prefecture is popular with history buffs, nature lovers, and those in search of culinary adventures. Perhaps most famous for its dinosaur museum, one of the best in the world, Fukui is also the birthplace of Echizen pottery and home to Eiheiji Temple, a headquarters of Zen Buddhism. It's also home to Maruoka Castle, one of 12 remaining original castles in the country, as well as the spectacular cliffs and coastline at Tojimbo. Lastly in the Hokuriku Shinetsu region is Ishikawa, which has strong connections to Japanese history and art. Since the completion of the Hokuriku Shinkansen line, it has become even easier to reach, taking only two hours by bullet train from Tokyo. The capital city of Kanazawa boasts important historical sites such as Kanazawa Castle and nearby Kenrokuen Garden, as well as samurai residences and historic tea districts where you can see geisha performances. Onsen towns like Kaga and Yamanaka Onsen are great places to unwind and you'll also want to try your hand at immersive experiences like lacquerware painting and making traditional wagashi sweets. There are so many destinations to choose from when it comes to visiting Japan that sometimes it can feel a little overwhelming. Just know that you really can't go wrong. No matter what part of Japan you visit, you'll have plenty of immersive activities, historical sites, and great outdoor adventures to choose from. That's all for us this time, but be sure to hit like and subscribe for more helpful Japan travel tips.